Ray, 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 Ray Serengowski. Serengowski. You heard Ray, Ray, Adobe, Adobe Audition. Audition. <laughs> Tutorials. Tutorials. Here. Our voiceoverguy.com. Shorty. Hey guys, it's Ray at our voiceoverguy.com. Thanks for joining me again. Another quick tutorial. This one goes out to all those who are mixing, mastering, or using any guitar tracks. I uh, got a couple requests from a few subscribers uh, asking about presets, um, VST plugins for Adobe Audition 3.0 that have to do with editing and mastering guitar tracks, adding effects, different things like that. A couple quick things to show you. I have a simple uh, guitar track here that I'm working on uh, for a song, and I'll let you hear that real quick. And the one thing that's really good when you're recording a guitar track is to always keep it uh, without effects as much as you can. Uh, if you've got a little de delay, a little reverb on it, that's okay. Try to keep it simple because once you put it in your DAW, your digital audio workstation, Adobe Audition 3.0, um, you want to go ahead and add the effects there. Um, there are some that come with um, Adobe Audition 3.0, which is really good. If you go to the Special tab uh, under Guitar Suite, um, there's some really nice presets right in here. Uh, you'll see Big and Dumb, Breakfast of Radiation, um, Mix and Mojo, Metal Screamer, and I'll play a couple of those for you so you get the idea. Uh, and then I'll show you another plugin that works out um, uh, equally as well, if not better. Um, but here's an idea of the original, and I'll go through a couple of them. But all in all, um, it is uh, a little limited, uh, if you will. There's probably about 10 presets on there. It doesn't give you exactly what you want. It's one sh extreme or the other. Uh, really, really cool. If you're looking to spend a, a few bucks, uh, between uh, 30 and 100 bucks, if you get the uh, uh, guitar, the GTR um, Waves plugin from Waves, um, you'll get this really cool setup right here. Um, which is their VST guitar tool rack stereo, which is really cool. Uh, you have enough here for six ports uh, or six pedals. The drop down window right here gives you everything um, basically that you'd want. Basically, you can create your own doing this. But if we pick a couple real quick, let's just say um, we got an axe press. On this one, we're going to do a chorus. Uh, on this one, we're going to put a wah wah pedal and a. Uh, picture bass. Let's do a metal one here and let's do a reverb here. Um, now you'll see here the red light on each one of these means they're all active and you don't want to do that. Um, uh, amazing horrid sound. If you're creating something for Halloween maybe it's a good idea. And what's nice these are as close to kind of original pedals that you'd be able to buy. Um, and Waves has a great plug-in set, and you can also add and adapt to your uh, pedal collection, if you will. Um, but you can uh, adjust the attack and the output of each one of these to kind of make it unique in your own. But just as is, I'll let you hear how those are played. I'll do them one at a time so you can hear. Here we go. <music>
But that's about it. Wanted to show you just another really quick, cool pl uh, pro um, plugin program uh, from Waves, which is really, really inexpensive uh, and a great addition to Adobe Audition 3.0. Uh, when you're doing any kind of mixing or mastering of your track. So, have any other questions? Hit me up at www.ourvoiceoverguy.com. We'll see you soon.